Good day everybody. Welcome to another one of my, my um, art journal pieces. Um, I just started off drawing a black kind of half circle and uh, it ended up into an eye and it just made me think about <clears throat> probably a couple of years ago when all I was doing was drawing and painting eyes so I looked it up on Google as you do and it said that if you are drawing painting or seeing eyes everywhere it is like opening some kind of a portal between you and the spiritual you and I thought that was pretty cool and uh, but I couldn't understand whether what that meant was it me trying to find God or something along the lines of that but um, I couldn't figure it out but it was still pretty cool and that's um, what I was doing and then I was talking to some other people who were doing the same thing they would just be doodling and drawing eyes and it's quite interesting you know but what I really want to do is I, I do these um, little videos mainly to encourage other people um, I, I'm, it's, I'm quite happy to do a drawing on my own without having to set up the tripod and, and all the rest of it you know um, but I, I think that if somebody can get something out of this um, it is, it is, it just makes a whole lot of difference for me because I feel like I've done something for somebody. So, regardless of what you are drawing, what you are painting, I just feel that you know, give, give this a go, just try doing something at night before you go to bed, um, just to finish off your day you know do a little drawing even with just a pen or a, or a pencil or whatever you know just do a little doodle because later on you will go back to it and you will have a look and you may find something in there you may see something to me spirituality is giving you know being humble being a little bit submissive sometimes you know spirituality to me means bonding with nature understanding how nature works um, you know like I, I can't really explain it I love um, going into my garden and just touching the leaves of a plant and just uh, being grateful that they're there and they are supplying me and my family with um, produce. Every time I go and pick a lemon off our lemon tree, I always say thank you. That is super spiritual. You know, you don't have to be religious to be spiritual. You just have to um, look deep inside yourself and also look deeply inside other people and find yourself in those people because we're all connected at the end of the day we're all humans and we have same thoughts and I know you're going to say like some people have really bad thoughts but we all share the same DNA really um, and not getting technical because I, I wouldn't even try to get technical about this because I have no clue <laughs> I'm just going by feeling and that's usually how I work and how I survive I just really trust my intuition and trust my feeling and whenever I'm confused and not sure about life and what I'm doing and which way I'm going I always try and find a uh, a peaceful space really inside myself and ask that question and you know um, 
a lot of the times I get an answer and all you have to do is listen listen to yourself you have all the answers you can google any question and you will get answered but none of them will be as true and as right as your own answer to whatever the question is so look inside yourself and the best way for us artists is to express by doing a drawing or doing a painting just step back and relax try not to judge once you allow your ego to take control you've lost you've lost every battle just relax and look into yourself and you will get your answers I guarantee you so here I am looking at this weird looking alien eye <laughs> that I just drew and it's looking back at me and I'm just thinking I'm happy with that you know because I like the colors and I love the feeling that I get from it it's just um, relaxing and that's what art does for me and once art becomes frustrating and annoying and something that becomes a task I will stop doing it because art is not meant to be a task it's meant to be an expression so I would like to encourage all of you watching this video now to go easy on yourself just brighten up your day do a little bright drawing or a painting and be happy about it because you know as I said before it is an expression of yourself and whatever colors you put in there are the colors that you are feeling at this moment so don't judge them don't judge them if they're murky or muddy or dark just be grateful to say to yourself this is me today tomorrow is another day be happy try to be happy sometimes life is hard I know that all too well and some people a lot of people have had it much harder than myself and I'm very grateful to one person in my life which is was my grandmother who taught me to be humble in life and to be grateful and that there's always somebody else who has got it harder than ourselves 